Hey everybody! How you all doing? <laughs> hey Pretzel, Fusion, Epic, Zinnia. I think I think that's everybody. Hey everyone. I forgot to update the sub goal. I'm not sure if it's changed since then. I need to update that. How you all doing? I would saw. Go. Fusion, have you not? Did you notice the Maya avatar is different now? We updated it a bit. It's looking a bit, uh, a bit more epic. Look at this. It, it like, let me get the older version up one second. So this was the older one. Oh yeah, oh, yeah, stream elements. Okay, so you got this one, and then you got this. So this is the new. This is like the updated version. But yeah, I'll, I'll switch to. Maya, real quick. I'll switch to Gordy, I mean. You got the pointy lashes. Alright. So today we're doing Sonic 3D Blast, we're doing the Genesis version. And then I think tomorrow... Um, hey Chicken. Either tomorrow or Thursday we're gonna do the Saturn version, if I can get it running on Retroarch. It just depends if I can get the emulator working. But yeah, um, we're going to do the director's cut of um, Sonic of Radio Blast. Eh, I want to I wanna try it because I've, I've never played the Saturn version before, so... i got to get the full experience, you know. And we'll also be doing Sonic Jam if I can get that working as well. Alrighty. That's very debatable. That's very debatable. I don't know, like, the, the general consensus I've seen is that the Saturn version is improved, but we'll see. We'll see. So I'm deciding if I should play the original version of um, Genesis or the or the um, director's cut. I love the music in the Saturn version. I play it on stream all the time. <laughs> That's surprising. Yeah, I'm gonna keep the uh, Mega Collection music playing for now. I, from what I heard, the the special stages were better in the Saturn version because the ones in <laughs> that's funny. <laughs> that's really funny. Because I I haven't played the Saturn version yet, and I haven't played the original in a really long time. Though I I can't really see for for certain just yet, <laughs> but that's pretty funny. <laughs> All right. So, yeah, today we're gonna do. I I, I think I want to try the director's cut because I haven't played it yet. Anyways. <laughs> yeah, the half pipe is like yeah it's a it's just so overused mainly. And half the time they just get it completely wrong. <laughs> Alright. So I'm gonna get um Sega Mega Drive classics up. I would use the em emulator, but I can't be bothered to download the ROM and everything. Okay. Let me get this up. So here, update on my um my do on my goal currently. So I'm currently at 170 British pound out of 420 uh, for my VR headset. Cuz we are saving up, we're pretty close. But we're almost we're close to halfway, I should say. Um, okay, let me turn that down a bit. We got money again. Okay. Oh yeah, yeah. I know, like, uh, okay. This is lagging a little bit. Okay, let me get game capture up real quick. Here we go. 
Let me get the stream up on my phone just so I can use that as like a second monitor. That's what I usually do during the Sonic streams, just so I can look at the chat while I'm playing. Alright. Here we go. Yeah, well, we'll see how I feel once I get to the Genesis, once I get to the Saturn version, because again, I still haven't played it. Basically, it has, like, higher quality graphics, different music, some of the changes. It has different special stages, too. Alright, here it is. So I think we're going to do the director's cut, because I haven't played it before. Um, basically, what it does is it increases the speed, general speed of the game. It also adds in Super Sonic 2. Um, it, it makes a bunch of a little quality of life changes, and I have never played it before. So we're going to try it out. I think that should be fun. Also, it's a funny, funny detail. They included, they changed it to like the UK version in the game. That's pretty funny. Uh, I'm not sure if that's loud enough. I'm gonna put that up to twenty-one minus twenty-one. Okay. How does this sound? Testing, testing. Okay, I think that's perfect. The director's cuffs. Oh yeah, also has a level editor too, which is really funny. Here we go. Blinky's mysterious birds. They live in other dimension, in other in in another dimension, and can travel anywhere through large rings. Robotnik learns about the Flickies. I will cha I will change the Flickies into robots and have them search for the Chaos Emeralds for me. Using the infinite, infinite, infinite power of the Emeralds, I can conquer the world. Oh yeah, that song was in Sonic Adventure as well. His friends are robots! <laughs> oh, this is tragic. Okay, I forgot to unbind the, uh, the rewind button. Sonic made my friends like this. I must save them. Robotnik must be stopped. Sonic starts to debate the em enemies in order to rescue the Flickies who are trapped inside. Go on, Sonic. You can warp through the blue big wing, big rings, and with the help of the Flickies, chase after Robotnik and defeat his plans. You know, I wonder if the rings being used as, um... I wonder if the rings being used as portals was, was, uh, the inspiration for the rings in the Sonic movie. That I'm thinking about. Yeah, Goy's formal name is Mix Goals. Because their surname is canonically Goat, and then they go by Mix instead of Mister. So I have not played this game in a really long time. Uh, is that loud enough? I think that's loud enough. Whenever I hear this song, all I can think of is Sammy Classic Sonic Fan, because he used this song in his intro. <laughs> I can just think of, like Sonic, like Sonic, like Sonic, like Sonic! Um, I definitely like the gameplay in the sun, especially. <laughs> oh, I see. Oh dang it. Okay, I'm just getting adjusted to these controls. I mean, it's definitely an interesting... I remember what the... I, I do vaguely remember the special stages in this game, but I don't remember them being like... They're like, they're, they're unique, but not super interesting. Well, I guess we'll see. Uh, usually in these games, unless like, I've been kind of like on and off getting the Chaos Emeralds. It just depends if like, if I actually actually get like something for doing them, then I'll usually do it. If it's not too much of a pain. But it depends really. So like, 
Sonic 2 I didn't bother because Sonic 2 special stages are appearing. Sonic 3 I had to because it's Sonic 3. And Sonic 3 and Knuckles I should say. Um, Sonic 2 8 bit I did it because I wanted to like give it a try. Because I know how like infamous that game is, but really I didn't have that bad of a time with Sonic 2 8 bit, surprisingly. Um Sonic 1 8 bit I don't think I bothered. Sonic 1 8 uh, the original Sonic 1 I did too actually. Um, it's like this game, I don't think I'm gonna... I don't know how difficult the special stages are, I guess we'll find out. Depending on how hard they are, I'll, I might try and get the emeralds, but I'm not too sure. Oh yeah, and this is basically the precursor to the... Um, to the homing attack, I think. I think this was... I know there was one shield in this game that lets you home, hone in on enemies. I'm not sure if this is it or not. Though. Crazy. You need shrinky 50 rings, okay. Do-do-do. Okay. We're still having this discussion about the special stages. Oh, it followed. Yo, stuck! Thanks for following. <laughs> yeah, thanks for dropping by, Stuck. We're playing the best Sonic game. We're playing 3D Blast. So good. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna put these in here just so I don't lose them. No, oh, no. Okay, I don't think I have to get the shield for that, but I lost the shield, so. Uh, where are they? Bye. Okay, that's the area before. I haven't played this game in a very long time, so I'm just kind of trying to readjust to it. Wait. Okay. Oh, that's Tails. Let's go. Oh, I didn't have enough rings for the... I think, anyway. I just remember the Photoshop meme that I... I remember like the Photoshop meme of just Tails shooting Omo Chao in the head. That was such a good meme. So up to the flies. Oh yeah, people were like losing it and being really melodramatic about it. <laughs> that was really funny. So for those who don't know, uh, Minecraft Dream streamed Toontown last night and people were really losing it about it. <laughs> it was really funny. And I, I like made a tweet basically saying like, oh my god, he's playing Toontown. And he had like loads of people replying and being like really <laughs> melodramatic saying it was gonna kill the game. You know, which is pretty ridiculous. <laughs> like yeah, we might have like a few people who stop playing because Dream played it, but it's pretty unlikely. Yeah. It's just really funny. Okay, there's the other enemy. There we go. Nope, there it is. It was just so funny watching that unfold last night. <laughs> oh, great. Where'd the other. There he is. Alright. No! I think this is one of those games that would definitely benefit 
benefit from a wider, from like a modern re-release. Just give it like a modern aspect ratio, a modern resolution, I think this game would definitely work a bit better. Just have a wider field of view. Let's go. It's definitely worrisome. Yeah, it's like... At the very more, at the very most, she might have like one new person. You might have like a few people <laughs> coming in, but that's really it. And people kind of like exaggerate. People really love to be hyperbolic <laughs> about this sort of thing. Uh, <laughs> you watch streams in here? <laughs> Yeah, people throwing hissy- just people throwing a hissy vet, mostly. <laughs> okay. I don't know, I- generally I just dislike gatekeeping as well. Like, I just don't like it when people try and gatekeep. Like, it's- it's a dumb Disney game from like, 20 years ago. <laughs> Like, it turns 20 next year. I don't know why people like to gear keep it so much. It was really funny. Uh, Resolution. Yeah. Like, you could argue this is like T -T Toontown's peak, because we haven't had this many people on Toontown since, like, well, watching Toontown, I should say, and, like, really ever. I don't think any of the Quacky streams had more viewers. Um, so, Toontown's kinda in a unique situation where the original game closed in 2013, um, but li the game basically lives on through private servers, so you have Toontown rewritten, which is basically just the original Toontown with new content. Uh, and then there's private servers like Corporate Clash, which don't have as many players, but uh, essentially big fan games that, that add a ton of new content. So it's it's a, in a definitely it's a really it's in a really unique situation. Like it still has a pretty good amount of players overall. Um, like big things. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's really funny. <laughs> It's just really funny how... Just the fact that Dream of all people played it, like... The biggest Minecraft YouTuber, it's like, just such a meme. It really feels like a fever dream. Um... Yeah. It feels like that's kind of become a trend as of late, where like... A lot- you'll have like a lot of YouTubers, like Dream and whatnot, playing obscure games like Toontown, just for their channels, and it's really f It is pretty fun, it's a good way to get exposure to those games as well. Oh. Where'd the other flicky go? Oh, he went over there! Get over here. No. Oh. Could it that be a... <laughs> That's pretty funny. It's Michael Jordan starts a fast food chain. Alrighty. Oh god. Okay. Oh! There we go. Gotta get two more of them. I'm looking forward to the Sonic R stream in a bit. I think, like, once I, once I finish, I'll be... Once you start, I'll be just about to finish. So, I like ready you right as you're starting, I think. That's basically what I'm gonna do. If I can. Uh, Toontown private servers. Oh, yeah, 2020. I might be misremembering, but I remember in like 2015 when I was playing TTR actively, you would often have about 4,000 people on during the weekends, during peak hours. And it feels like TTR's definitely, like, declined a bit since then, but it's still doing decently well. You can kind of tell the game's, like, kind of petering out a bit over time, but it's still doing, like, fairly well. 
Because Toontown fans are really dedicated to the game. It's definitely like one of the most dedicated fan bases out there. Okay, ah, oh, dang it. There we go. Sonic 3D bats. Imagine doing college work. <laughs> they got rid. It 2021 is like one of the best years we've had for Toontown in a really long time. Because we had like three major content updates from different servers. You know, we had we started off with Legation Team, you know, we started off with Vocal. And uh, then we had Clash 1.5, 1. 1. I think. Well, what was it? 1.5? 1. 1. 1. 1.2.5, that was it. 1.2.5, yeah. yeah. And then you had Field Officers finally coming out too. Which, I'm hoping Cashbot Field Officers or whatever they do next doesn't take too long. If we have to wait another five years for whatever TTR's doing next, it's gonna really <laughs> be all, that's gonna... I'm hoping they're finally, like, getting on Shrek with releasing content. Summers. Yeah, that's like the biggest issue with 2021 is just the summer is really dry. I think for me, like, this summer was really, this was a really active summer for me, like, I was just, it was a really fun summer where I was just playing Toontown with friends all day every, all day during the summer. So it didn't really feel dead for me, but I know, like, overall it was a pretty dormant summer. Raccoon! Coon Rack. Oh yeah, we have a boss afterwards, I forgot. Alright, this boss is kinda funny, he just drops these and then just slowly lowers down to pick them up. <laughs> Ingenious strategy there, Robotnik. Uh, both DTR and Clash are dancing with a gear. I mean, Toontown's kind of like... Mm -hmm. It's definitely in a unique situation. Oh, crap. We're really lucky, like, overall. Ah, oh, what? What was that? What was that? That's like my one issue, is just the angles are really funky. Okay, there we go. There you go. Oh, Maya. Okay. We'll switch back to Maya. Let's go, it's Maya. Yeah, I really like this updated Maya avatar. We actually just updated it, so let me show you like the original Maya real quick. So this is the new updated Maya. And this was the older one that Zinnia made. Yeah, I, I really like this new one quite a lot. It's really good. Yeah. I don't know why... Sega Mega Drive Cl Classics likes to lag my PC out, but oh well. Yo, this song's really... This song's a classic. I like it a lot, it's really nice. Uh, Disney... Uh, no, no, it's been, it was completely redrawn. Uh, Zinnia redrew it from scratch and it looks really good. What was I gonna... Oh yeah, the uh, eye color is also more consistent with like the Busy and the Raccoon Maya one. So yeah, we, we cleaned it up a bit, made it more consistent. So I was gonna say, like, one thing about Toontown that I'm really afraid, that I... Some people might say this is like an unpopular opinion, but I think the original Toontown closing was actually one of the best things that ever happened to Toontown. Because basically leaving the community the keys to the game was like... It just let stuff like Clash happen, you know? Something like that would have never happened otherwise. So it's just nice that we actually... 
Because to- Disney wasn't doing anything with Toontown for the past few years, for like the final few years that it was open. It was basically just left to rot for a while with no new content or anything. Uh, but now we're actually like finally getting new stuff. Club Penguin is kind of in a different situation where it was still receiving content when it closed. It's just, I think Disney kind of... I think what probably happened was Disney saw the writing on the wall for Flash and knew it was probably going to close in a few years, so they wanted to make a new game. That was probably what happened with Club Penguin. Oh yeah, Zinnia, it's really, really good. I love the avatars you've done. Just, just everything you've done for the Twitch, I really appreciate it. Zinnia's done a lot. Like, Zinnia's... Zinnia made the AFK screen. Um, he made the logo. Yeah, he made a bunch of stuff. Um, it's really amazing. Oh no. Oh, you, you, you noticed that? Yeah, it was really funny. We just had Dream playing Toontown. <laughs> Okay. Oh no. We all appreciate everything Zinnia does over here. Alright. Okay, so I gotta get on the, the the spinny wheel thing. Sonic Ballet 3D. Okay, so you got that area over there. Okay, don't get hit. I gotta take it slow here. I wonder what Nintendo will announce. If did they announce this gonna be one in February? Or is that like rumored? I haven't heard. Of, I haven't heard of that actually. I'm guessing it would make sense actually timing wise. Oh crap! I didn't mean to do that. I think February was is I think that's definitely a safe bet, actually. I think February is, like... Cause the last one was in, like... November? Oh, is it October? I don't recall, actually. It was a good while ago, though. Yeah, I could definitely see a February one happening. I'm not sure... I'm guessing they'd... I was gonna say, maybe they'll show Breath of the Wild, but I'm guessing they'll probably save that for E3. You never know, though. <laughs> new Smash Bros. character. Oh, I bet, I bet they're, gonna, they're gonna announce Flippy for Smash. <laughs> I'm actually, like, unsure what Nintendo's gonna announce. It feels like... Whatever they announce is gonna be a surprise. So I'm not sure what they've been working on as well. Here we go. Oh, that's the fire shield, okay. Oh yeah, Pikmin 4. I hope- I kinda hope we get the original two Pikmins ported over to the Switch someday as well. That's right, I really want to see them just port over a bunch of games. Ah, crap. Like, I want to see the M Metroid Prime- Oh, actually, 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 I think now, actually, I think this E3 would probably be the perfect time to show off Metro Prime 4. That's kind of wishful thinking, but maybe. Uh... Could be right to... Could be right to would be really awesome. I, I tried playing Air Ride 2 a while, but... Uh, I... Blah. I tried playing Air Ride a bit ago. Um. Oh, good. I tried playing Air Ride on Dolphin a couple years back, and I remember, like, playing it and just thinking, you can tell Sakurai worked on this with, like, the menus and everything. Suck of the Wild. You can really tell, like, Sakurai worked on uh, Air Ride with, like, the menus and everything. Alright. I need to go fill my I need to go fill my drink in a minute.
Oh yeah, My Replacement Robins 2 is coming out as well. That's coming out in like, a couple months, right? I'm actually looking forward to that one, because that game's really fun. I gotta finish the first one, though. Wait, that was your nickname in high school? Uh, okay. Wait, where's the ring again? Some of these level layouts get a bit confusing as you go on. Now that I'm thinking about it, I don't think I ever got past the second zone ship. Oh no. No rings, no rings, no rings. Okay. I gotta be careful here. So I don't get owned. There we go. I probably missed something important. So there was a column over here, right? There was like something over here I need to see. Joe. Oh my god. You guys. You guys are degenerates. Okay. So there must be a... Uh, what's it called? Yeah, there you go. No, I haven't heard of Joe. I don't want to know who Joe is. Not it. Ah, oh, come on. Bruh. You guys. I don't care who Joe is. Okay, I gotta just take it slow here. Don't get owned by the funny moving spikes. Ah! Okay. There we go. You're a living disaster. Oh, sure. There we go. There we go! Gaming. Oh, there's another section. Of course there is. Of course there's another section. Oh, it was a newly discovered island in Hawaii. Oh. Oh, I'm not sure how that's pronounced. That's pretty cool. Though. Oh. Hello, Peter. Uh, I had that feeling in the back of my head. Like, oh god, is that gonna be another? <laughs> Oh. I haven't heard of that one before. That's a pretty good one. That's a pretty good D's Nuts joke. I had the feeling that you were jamping me. Oh, okay. One more, one more, one more. Can't believe I got jamped. Okay. Ah. Yeah. Oh, I'm one of them got away. God damn it! Stupid bird. Get over here. Well, that's a level down. <laughs> okay. Why well, almost said penis on the stream? What are you talking about? Oh yeah, so I was doing some grading on TTR, and um, Super Bo Super Goose joined one of my groups, and I was like, "Oh my god, do I green Super Goose? Do I mess with him in game?" <laughs> I was I was gonna go in with him, and then he had to go do something uh, right before we went in, <laughs> so he like managed to get out of me messing with him in a field office. <laughs> so that happened. Hey Alice, what's up? <laughs> and I got like a... So before he left, I was like, Alright, see you around, funny 50 man. Just to... I said that to him in the chat. 
And then, like, I think he immediately knew, like, it was at least somebody who recognized him. <laughs> so that was pretty funny. <laughs> it's gonna get a green super goose. <laughs> oh, and my control. I need to get a new wire for my controller. It's like, what's happening? It, like, just randomly disconnect and then reconnect. Alright. Passes a vibe check, add him to the new no green list. <laughs> oh god damn it, come on. I remember as a kid, like I always I would always get up to this this zone and just stop because this zone is really annoying. <laughs> uh Oh god damn it. Okay. Did I miss the other bird? Okay, wait, no, it's uh Alright, I'm just gonna send these in. I'm gonna nick him. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> I'm not sure if I heard of that story. It's funny. Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't think I heard that story. That's really funny. Yeah, that tr whole dream raid was really funny. It's funny to think, right? So that dream stream last night... Um, dream started streaming without any warning or anything. I'm not sure- I don't think he has like a, a Twitch schedule or anything. But he just went live with no warning or anything. Imagine if he basically organized it, so like, he made a, he made a YouTube video or a Twitter post beforehand basically saying, Alright, I'm gonna be streaming Toontown Rewritten at this time on this day. He would have completely crashed the servers if he had done that. <laughs> it's Toontown's dream for that to happen. <laughs> it's just such a funny thought. Okay. Oh wait, okay, that's the end, actually. That part. Ah, I see. I see, Alice. I had a laptop. Funny story, actually. So, about a year, it's about two years ago. I got a, I got a laptop, but it was a hand-me-down from a family member, and that laptop still had a password on, and there wasn't really, and I had the password right, but I think there was also a pin or something like that. Yeah, I think there was both a pin and a password on it. I knew the password, but not the PIN. And what ended up happening was... The laptop had really bad storage. And... I'm trying to think of, like how to explain the story without it sounding weird. So I had this laptop, and the storage got like completely full. And when Windows laptops go in, have like too much store, don't have enough storage, they go into like this mode where you're forced to delete something, or the laptop will just refuse to start, basically. And you needed to put in the pin um, to actually, like, un uninstall anything. So basically, I got fucked out my laptop, and I can't access it anymore, because I don't have the pin. So that's pretty funny. <laughs> I gin the gin. It's rare to see somebody streaming this game. That's true. <laughs> I like... I'm, I'm doing a bit of a Sonic marathon where I'm playing, playing every single Sonic game on stream. So that's why we're streaming it currently. We're just trying to get this game done. <laughs> so then after that we can move on to... We're gonna do Sonic Jam after this, and then Sonic Schoolhouse. That's how dedicated we are to the Sonic marathon. <laughs> and then after that, we're doing... Um... I think after that, it's Sonic Pocket Adventure and then Sonic Adventure. So. The dream playing TTR, maybe. Oh, yeah. I actually can't go on TTR. Uh. Because I'm IP banned, so. <laughs> Just for all the greening I would do. Thought you were for some reason. 
Uh, yeah, I'm doing Sonic Jam and also uh, the Saturn port as well. Ah, oh, dang it. Okay. So, yeah, I'm doing quite. I've got quite a lot of Sonic games to burn through still. But we we have like we only have like four classic Sonic games left before we enter the modern era with Adventure. So that's gonna be really interesting. Hamster dance. Oh no, okay, there we go. Yo, MS Pain Doodle. Uh, I hope that open world. I really hope it's good. I really. It, after forces and whatnot, I really hope it's good. Like, we've just been burnt so many times. Alright, what do you want me to draw? Uh, chicken. Okay. Mega Mix? Oh, Mega Mix from Crush? Alright. Yeah, I'll quickly draw. I'll get some painting music on. Wait, 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 wait. I'm gonna get the Mario Paint. Wait, uh, creative exercise Mario Paint. Get the Mario Paint music on. Yeah. Yeah, he's the guy who writes the IDW comics. Which are really good. Um, those comics are really top notch. So that gives me that gives me a bit of hope at least. So the guys they had the guys they had writing the Sonic games previously were like they just got them they just they just got random people who kn knew nothing about Sonic and they openly admitted to getting their Sonic knowledge off Wikipedia. <laughs> so at least now we have a writer who actually knows something about Sonic, which is really funny. Um okay. MS Paint. Here we go. Alright, we're gonna play the Mario Paint music. Do, 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 do. Alright. Let me get the Mega Mix picture. Why is Sega Mega Drive Classics lagging my PC out so badly? Oh god. <laughs> I don't know why it's so laggy, but oh well. Alright, copy. We'll see if it ends up being any good or not. Okay, so there's uh, Mega Mix. The draw like the hair here. It's got the N. Wait, no. Okay. So the eye. It's the eye. So here's the funny eye. Uh, then we've got like a bolt in here. Nope. Alright. Da da da. Okay. So he's got bad teeth. He's British or something. He's got an angry eyebrow. There you go, this looks pretty good, I think. He's got like this here. He's got like a neck bead. There we go, this is incredible. Look at this. He's got his ear. Yeah. Look at this. Then you got uh, the shoulder pad. got like claws. Look at this, this is incredible. Look at this big dude. So here we got Mega Mix. Got the dingo dial feet. Da, 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 da. Da, 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 da. 
So you got oh you got to draw the belts. Uh, he's got like the arm here. He's got spiky. He's got like the spikes. Oh yeah, I started um, to stream a little bit early today because I have some stuff I need to take care of. But yeah, we're just doing the funny MSPN sketch for chicken. Okay, here you go. So now we got to colour it in. <laughs> here we go. Also, a uh, big shocker. I had a uh, McDonald's for today. I had like some chicken nuggets, so it was pretty good. Go eating chicken again? Who would have guessed? Da, 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 da. Da, 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 da. So if I'm gonna like skim through the colors and just leak. Da, 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 da. Okay. <laughs> oh my god, it's Freckle Slam! <laughs> the real Freckle Slam! <laughs> All right. Do 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 do. Here we go. Now we got the belts. Oh yeah, and then the bottom part of the body has got a scaly body. You know, I'm just thinking, so I made that tweet a while back where it was like, okay, I really love alligator villains. And it was like, you had a bunch of you had like a picture of... Wait, let me just show it on the stream, actually. Here it is. <laughs> I love this one tweet that I made. I... I'm not sure about that one. I imagine they probably did. Sega love Sega used to do that a lot where they just take <laughs> so okay. I really like this tweet I made where it was a alligator villain appreciation post. We need more alligator villains because they're epic. You know you got K rule. You know this is lagging a bit. You got K rule. You know you got Toffee from Star Star Versus. Then you got the Litigator. And then there's the legend himself. The legend. <laughs> and we also have Monty now, that is also true. You know, Evil Alligator is my favorite uh, alligator villain, he's so good. So, what a legend. Alright. I, I really love just how out, out of players Evil Alligator looks in that. Uh, hello everyone. I am Evil Alligator. Okay. Pull those in. Do all that. Yep. Yeah. Do the thing. Do this color. I'm kind of like speed running the rest of this now, so I can get back to gaming. But from here on out, I'm just gonna use the default colors. <laughs> oh wait, wait, wait! Actually, unless I just do this. Uh... Oh yeah, I need to color that bin, bit in like an orange. There you go, perfect. <laughs> there you go, my good friend played trolley games. Yeah. Yeah, you had... was it Evan or... I think it was... I know King Blue was there, was either Evan or... Nico was it? I don't recall. Mega Mix... Mega Mix... Yeah, Evan, okay. 
Okay, I'm gonna put this in general. There's the Mega Mix. I think one of my issues is like... <laughs> I tend to put too much time and effort into these dumb MSPN sketches. Cause I'm kind of a, I'm kind of a perfectionist like that. And also since somebody donated like... Since they do so many channel... Since so many channel books, like 5,000, 5, I want to make sure it looks good. So I, I tend to take up my time with it. <laughs> Alright. That took like 10 minutes. Uh, back to gaming, I guess. <laughs> back to gaming. Alright. Controller is here. No, oh, no. Okay. Oh, there we go. Wait, that was an extra life, alright. This game, so far, isn't really too difficult. The only time I came... I say that right, I get... Why does this always happen? I, like... This happens in literally every Sonic stream, where I'll say, like, okay, this game isn't too hard or whatever. And then I'll just get hit over and over like that. <laughs> That happens literally every time. There's like a ton of clips of that happening, where I'll just like say, oh this isn't too hard, and then I'll die instantly. <laughs> okay. Oh no. Uh, Zinni is... We are very sus susceptible at jinxing. Zinni should be here, Zinni is... Just, uh... Unless Zinni is, like, going to do something. Zinni was here, like, a few minutes ago. Okay. Oh, where's the other one? Get oh, god damn it! Ah, uh, okay, there we go. I've got some rings. You stupid ass bird! You know these birds aren't as bad as like Baby Mario in Yoshi's Island, but oh my god. I want to punch these birds in the face. Just the annoying chirp they make when they get hit. When you lose the birds. Ah. Okay. So I gotta just slowly jump from plat- Ah, why is this so hard? Okay, I'm gonna try and use the drop shadow if I can. Oh, the little wood? That's a good YouTuber. I, I watch him play- I, I watch his Fortnite tutorials. He's pretty- Dang it! I miss when he did Minecraft. I miss when he did, uh... He was like part of the Yogg's cast back in the day. You know what's screwed and never. Oh, I could just jump across, okay. <laughs> ah Thank you, game. Oh, and that's the final enemy. Good to know I could have just done that. The whole time. Oh, Shimmy's doing Minecraft today. Very nice. Okay. I actually don't. I need, I need to watch Shumi a bit more. I don't really watch a. I don't really watch streams a whole lot.
a lot of the time, if it's, it's, it's blah, a lot of the time, like a streamer will be busy while I'm, I'll be busy while a stream is live as well. That tends to happen quite a bit. She is, like, I haven't watched her a whole lot, but she is pretty, like, wholesome from what I've seen. This streams have, like, a really nice vibe. Okay, that. Oh, why'd I jump? I shouldn't have done that. Whoops. I don't really, like... Ah, crap. I don't really watch a whole lot of streamers besides you and Nick, if I'm, if I'm thinking of, not thinking about it. <laughs> yeah, I think it's just, like, you and Nick, for the most part. Okay. Oh, god damn it. Stupid birds. Why did they make it so the birds actually get hit without... Uh, that's so dumb. Okay, wait, isn't the ring over here? I can just turn the birds in. Uh... Oh, you don't know him, Zinnia? I watch his, like, he does, like, Fortnite guides and how to do certain quests. That's what I always just watch him for. And also, I watched him back in the day when he was part of the Yogg's cast. Um... Nope. No, you don't know who he is. I think, like, I was just thinking, like, okay, what other streamers do I watch besides, like, Stuck and Nick? I guess I watch, like, there's some friends I have who stream who I try and watch when they're live. Uh, not a whole lot, though. Oh, yeah, I, I try and... Uh, catch Horseplay if he's live as well. Horseplay is pretty funny. I really enjoy Horseplay streams. Yeah, Horseplay is great. Um, I always like to joke during Horseplay streams, like, oh my god, it's Horseplay from the Toontown visual novel. <laughs> I'm like the only... I think like me and one of a friend are like the only people who remember that. <laughs> I always just meme about that. I'm, like, debating if I should... I probably have to ask Nick if he doesn't really care first, but I have to ask Nick if he's okay with me playing the visual novel on stream someday. So that'd be pretty funny. <laughs> Finally done with this one. Oh god. Well, almost done anyways. Uh, call horseplay donut horse. I was talking about Don Dunkin' Donuts for 20 minutes. Oh man. Oh! This thing I gotta. No? Dang it. Okay, wait, what? Oh, okay. I don't know what happened there, I don't know why I got hit. I just gotta be careful not to get warned. I'm probably gonna die, but you know. <laughs> oh, I missed a jump! This is the type of game where I really question why they did it on the Genesis and didn't just keep it on the Saturn. This game plays, does not play great with a D-pad. Uh... Okay. Alright. Oh, okay. Oh, 
Oh, there we go. I am. I don't think he would have done that intentionally, though, Alice. Okay, Spring Stadium. I've never made it this far into this game, so this should be interesting. Oh shit! Oh, thanks for Freckle Slam. Thanks for gifting a sub to Stug. <laughs> I really love the alert, where it's just um, <laughs> I think you've probably seen the alert, where it's just it's a guy who looks like Jesse Shell just getting hit by a gift. I know that guy for some reason just really resembles Jesse Shell. <laughs> so I thought, okay, that's perfect for the gift uh, for the gift alert. I do, that's that's for um I think it was under fifty bits. But I have like some specific uh, bit amounts though as well, so I think if you you have to donate like a specific amount. Let me get my uh let me check real quick. What were the bit amounts again? Oh Thanks for the donation. But I think my colleagues would call you a short change. There it is. <laughs> Thank you, Stug. <laughs> yeah, sorry it lagged a bit there. I was like opening Firefox while you donated the bits. <laughs> okay, let me fix this. Hopefully it won't lag as bad now. I don't know why this this the uh, Genesis emulator is so laggy. It, it just lags the stream out for some reason. But thankfully, this is the last time I have to use it. Oh yeah, now you you have access to all the amazing emotes. You got the uh, you got the Maya Greened, Maya Pog, the Maya Lull, Busy Shock, Busy Face Bomb, the Goaty Grin. I really wanted to do a bunch of follower emotes, but I don't have access to them right now for whatever reason. Which is the sheer. Alright. I think you need to like stream for a certain amount of days or something like that. That'd be really funny. So my current plan for like the follower emotes is to have them all just be the goalie variations. Uh, the current Gorty emote is like, it, that's gonna be moved to a follower emote. And yeah. I have a bunch of plans in mind for like the next few emotes. Like, I need to do a Toontown Gamer emote. And I also wanna maybe include I wanna do a Smarty emote maybe. Oh, okay, top. The guy who made uh, Thanos just sent me a Steam message. <laughs> uh. Yeah, I really love the gooey ones. Original character. <laughs> it's just, he just sent me a picture of his original from TF2. It's just called Original the Character. Do not steal. That's such a good Sonic reference. Alright. Thanosaurus is such a curse tune. That's the type of tune I could imagine Zinnia making, actually. Zinnia ever, Zinnia ever plays Toontown, he just makes Thanos as a horse or something. I could imagine, that's the type of thing I could imagine Zinnia doing. Oh! Okay, that should have owned me! But, here, you know. Because you're a Marvel nerd, that's your whole thing. Ah, uh, this is like the worst place I could have lost a Flicky to. Okay. Where's that damn fifth Flicky? I'm gonna go put these through the wing ring so I don't lose them. 
probably my idea. Oh yeah, you got the Maya dancer more too. You also got the hamsters. I really love the uh I really love the new Stucker mods, those are really good. Uh what do you talk what do you mean, uh, Malice? What are you trying to get help for? Oh, you mean the remenu? Oh, uh There's probably temp there's probably like a green screen or something you could use. Um if you have any kind of like video editing software. There's probably some kind of like Wii green screen you could use. Um you could just edit that in like Sony Vegas if you have some kind of video editing software. I mean, if you want, I could help you out a bit. Um, I'll, I'll, I could like sort that out sometime. I can probably help uh, make something for you. All right. Uh, if I watch an ad over and over, I think it would. But the thing with Twitch, I think ad revenue on Twitch is like not great. So I don't really care much for ads. I've never really cared for ads at all. <laughs> Yo, it's tails. Oh, okay. Well, <laughs> well, that just happened. All right. Well. Uh, yeah, that's the main thing right now, is the, uh, the donations, just the bits and everything. Because for those who, uh, might have tuned in, we're currently saving up for a VR headset, and we're almost halfway there. We have, like, 170 British pounds out of, uh, 420. <laughs> so, uh, about 40 pounds from halfway there. Birch Draper. You can just call me Birch. I think it's high to- wait a second. This is the wrong script. Uh, let, let me see here. Oh, right, right. Uh, thanks for the bits, you wonderful patron. Where's Raccoon? <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I forgot that alert was a thing. <laughs> I, I don't think anyone's really gonna get the joke for that one. <laughs> but basically... Uh, that starts out with me reading the script to coach these furry fanfiction. <laughs> and it then... <laughs> uh, but thank you, Stuck, for the 69 bits. <laughs> <laughs> so yes, yeah, so like, coach has like a... <laughs> coach has like a whole furry audio drama series where that falls dipper. And I like that was the opening of the story, and I was just reading that out. <laughs> it's incredible. Oh no. Yo, Knuckles. Oh yeah, Goat Story, the best movie. I love Goat Story. I, re I think I made a tweet before where it was like the poster of Goat Story. And it was like, this movie is my Black Panther. It empowers goats everywhere across the world or something like that. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Oh god. Oh 
There you go. Oh. Okay. Uh, okay, two more of these left. Oh! Okay, this one's not too bad. This level's... This level could be worse. Shoot me a mode. But all the shoot me a mode. Ah, my hand. So I'm not sure what time Pretzel starts their stream. I guess we'll see. So Pretzel's streaming Sonic R in a couple hours. Uh, so I was gonna go raid them. I was gonna like hang out and voice chat with them as well. So you'll be able to hear a bit more of me after <laughs> I go raid them. So that should be fun. I've done that before with like cry streams, those are always fun to do. Just reading somebody and then joining them in the call. It's always really fun. Alright. Eventually I'm hopefully gonna be able to do another collab stream with somebody. Not sure who, but like the one we did recently with um Tronic with uh, Captain Tom and Smarty Pants, that one was really fun. So I want to hopefully do more eventually. I'll probably do another one with Shronicon like, decently soon. Uh, with Captain Tom, I should say. He, he goes by both Captain Tom, to Captain Tom and Shronicon, so... Oh yeah, Chicken, I'd love to do one with you as well someday. We could do, like, Crush Team Racing or something, maybe. Alright, back to... Ah, I'm getting, like, hand cramp. I'm just, like... This control... I don't know why the PS4 controller is, like... Ah, okay. I will say for a Genesis game, like a late Genesis game, this game is like fairly impressive. The fact that they got it all working in a Genesis. Oh no. Because I, I do need to use my capture card some more for streaming. So far I've only really done like Mario Kart and Smash. So I do want to try some more uh, Switch games in the future. I really do want to do. I really do want to do another Mario Kart stream sometime. It's also really fun. I'm thinking as well. Like fairly soon, I also want to do another 12-hour stream. But I just need to find the time to do it because I've been kind of busy as of late. Thankfully, this week I'm like I'm finally not as busy because I've had a lot going on lately. But um. So Wednesday, tomorrow, I'm off college because it's like a training day. Um, and then Thursday, I'm always off college. And then Friday, I, I'm not really sure what I'm doing on Friday. Uh, one day ago... Oh, you know this Toontown Gamer? The Toontown Gamer who played Sonic Jam on stream! <laughs> Let's go! I think, you know what, that's... I'd be pretty proud of that, you know, the Toontown player who streamed Sonic Jam once. Oh yeah, same week you got school work. It's unfortunate. I'm just deciding what I want to... I think this Thursday, really, I just want to have... I think this Wednesday and Thursday, I just want to chill out. Because I've been so busy as of late. But I've hardly had any time to like play games or anything. Cause I have so many games and every and whatnot I really want to play, but just haven't had the time to. So I want to do that. All right, where's the exit? 
Oh yeah, Sonic Jam was basically them kind of laying the groundwork for uh, some of the Sonic games that would come out around the time. Like, in, like Sonic, um... Like, what was I saying? It was, they were, were basically laying the groundwork for Sonic Adventure in that game. Ah, shit, which one are you missing? Wait, how did I miss that flicky all the way over there? Oh god, get over here! What are you doing? Uh, if you'd like, if you want to, Zinni, I'd be down to. Oh god damn it. I still need to finish Security Breach. I'm at 5am, but I need to actually finish it. Oh, that's the stupid bird. Get over here. Okay. Here we go. No, get over here. Get over here, bro. Dang it. Alright. Oh. Yo, there's Knuckles and Tails just vibing. Ah, oh, what? I hate these birds so much. Ah. Okay. How many zones are there in this game, actually? I'm gonna quickly check just how many zones are in here. Uh, Sonic, 3D, Blast, uh, Sonic, Wiki. How many zones are there? Uh... Where is it? Where is all the... I'm trying to find this on the wiki. Alright, here it is. Oh, that's eight zones? Oh, there's like seven zones. Ugh. Oh, this is gonna take so long. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna do the whole game. Oh, god. We're only at zone three out of seven and I'm exhausted. <laughs> I think this is a similar situation in Knuckles Kyoix, where, like, I could keep going and finish it, but, like, do I really want to? <laughs> I think we'll, like, keep going a bit longer, and then I'm just gonna... vibe. I think after this zone, I'd be down to just do something else for a bit. If anyone has any suggestions on what to do... Alright. Dang it. A pinball, maybe. Oh yeah, I'm not sure if you're still here, Stuck. But I was thinking, like, for a bit alert, I was gonna do Cool Party. <laughs> but like... I'm not sure how many bits it would be, but... For a certain amount of bits, it would just be me saying, Cool pie, cool pie, cool pie, cool pie, cool pie. I think that'd be pretty fun. No, I'm not gonna play a fiddle. Crash Bandicoot. Hmm, I have the ROM. I have the ROM installed. I <laughs> got seeing the look. Sing the love song. <laughs> awesome 100. It's like this Fortnite video I saw yesterday. I have to show this video on stream. It reminds me. It reminds me of the funny Fortnite video. Does anyone know what I'm talking about? I think. Where? 
Ah. A crush breakout? <laughs> oh! Oh yeah, that, that Crush Breakout game looks incredible. Oh, come on, get over here. You have seen the videos in here. I'm being big on purpose though, because it's, it's a pretty good video. God damn it. Yeah, this is... This game isn't nearly as frustrating as I thought it would be, but it is driving me up the wall a bit. Like, this game is just annoying. I'm getting hit literally every opportunity, but I'm not dying because this game's too easy. <laughs> That's like the main thing with this game. Here we go. Let's go. Okay. Do I just... Guessing I got it. Dang it. Okay, yeah. I just gotta be careful not to get hit! Ah, what? Dang it. It's one of those bosses, I hate this. It always feels like every single Sonic game I've played on this marathon has at least one boss that annoys me, like, really badly. <laughs> I guess this is the one. It's the one that annoys God. Oh, yep, there you go. <laughs> uh, who designed this? Am I doing it wrong? Is there something I'm missing here? I'm supposed to... yeah. Yeah. This has got to be right. Aw, oh, what? I jumped on him. What happened? What happened? Uh, okay, I'm gonna lure him over here. Oh yeah, fuck it. Okay, one more hit, I think. One more hit. Oh! Fucking controls. Dang it. Oh, come on! These controls are garbage. Like, actual garbage. Okay. 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 Over here, over here, over here, buddy. Over here. Yeah, alright, Kim. Alright. Show, sure, buddy. Show, sure, buddy. Kim over here. Oh, come on! Wait. Wait! 
Is he lowering himself down when he's doing that attack and I didn't notice till now? Because this game's... I'm only just realizing he does that now. Oh my god, I'm stupid. Wait, I, I don't know if that's my fault or if the game's just not making it clear enough that he's like lowering himself down. I don't know, do you guys, did you guys pick up on that before me? Or am I just really stupid? Because I don't know. It feels like the angle is like not making it clear enough that he's like lowering himself because it's an isometric. There we go. All right. Gaming. Uh. All right, I'm gonna. Uh. Hmm. Do I keep going with this? Oh. The song's iconic though, this is such a good song. I'm gonna keep going for a little bit. But yeah. I'm just gonna quickly check something, I'll be Scott's fit. <laughs> tell you what, tell you what. Ugh. I'm gonna, there's a, so I have the coin on my desk, um, that I use for the busy streams. I still have it on my desk, right? I'm gonna flip this coin. If it lands on heads, I keep going. If it lands on tails, I, uh, do something else. Heads, keep going, tails, do something else. Where'd the coin go? Ah, fuck, it landed on head. It landed on heads. Ah, kill me. Okay. <laughs> Alrighty. I guess we keep going for now. Oh, and I, we have to keep going on the ice level too. The ice level in Sonic 3D Blast. Oh, jolly. Oh my god, I can't kill him without getting hit 50 times. Look at this dude on his pogo stick. That's such a, that's such a good enemy design. It is funny how the enemies themselves aren't really a threat at all. Like, look, they, they just walk around aimlessly. <laughs> but then the actual, like, ha the real enemies of this game is the levels, the level layouts, because you're always running into shit. <laughs> That's basically the gist of it. You're just always running into shit. <laughs> and that's the real hazard. Just not running into all the crap scattered about. It's like they knew and just had to compensate. Wait. Oh, that's the flip. Wait, the f is that the flicky right there? He's just inside the ice. Yeah, okay, that's fine. I do like this game's soundtrack, though. This game's soundtrack is really, really good. I don't know why, but Sonic games just have this tendency to have, like, even in some of the worst Sonic games, you'll have some really damn good music. Yo, know, this game, Sonic Un Sonic, um, I almost said Sonic Unleashed, but Sonic Unleashed is actually good. Sonic 06 has some really banging music. I don't know what it is with Sonic games and just having some of the best OSTs in gaming, but here we are. But even the poopy games. There we go. Dang it. Oh, 
Alright, uh... I'm just thinking, like, what else we can do with it, because I'm... I feel like streaming today, but, like, I'm just tired of Sonic 3D Blast. One can only handle so much Sonic 3D Blast in one sitting. <laughs> it's stuck. <laughs> I'm just contemplating if we should keep going with this, or if we should just do something else, because I'm getting tired of Sonic 3D Blast. <laughs> Oh, I'm supposed to touch that, okay. Oh, come on. Oh. Hmm. Maybe I'll do Minecraft, I'm not sure. Eh, uh, we'll see. Okay, there we go. There we go. Now don't get hit. Oh, we actually... So we did that in a previous stream, where we... In a previous stream, I did like a Minecraft speedrun, quote-unquote. I just went into creative mode, placed down like an end bottle as fast as I possibly could, and then killed the ender dragon with a console command. And I think my record was like... 15 seconds or something like that. I have the clip of it saved. It's pretty funny. I was like, eat your heart out, dream. Bird. Bird. Okay. Yeah, that's fair with Toontown Archive. I think it's kind of a novelty, and it's definitely cool as like a his- It's like a historic preservation. <laughs> but like a video, I don't- I'm not sure if there's really a whole lot to really do. Hey, Alice. Thanks for taking my rings, Tails. You just took my life savings away. Wait, how do I get out of here without dying? Wait. Oh, okay, I just jump. Never mind. Wait. Can I get up here without... Oh, I can just jump up. Okay, never mind. I re- Oh, okay. I really loved my reaction. My reaction to the Sonic Movie 2 trailer was really fun. Cause like, you could just hear- I was just getting very excited, I was just shouting, like, Oh my god, Sonic's got a chili dog, I was like, shouting stuff like that. And like, my friend Bebo was in the call with me, just making fun of me for being such a big Sonic nerd. That was pretty funny. Yeah, you know, my and my reaction to that was just, hey look, I'm a slave to this franchise, you know. <laughs> it's funny because like Sonic's been succeeding in pretty much every area except games right now. You know the the show look the show looks pretty good. The music the movie is blah, blah, blah. the movie's really good. The shows have been the shows looks the shows have been pretty good. Oh, that's been good. Comics are getting better, but the games are not great right now. Okay. I need a drink, like, really bad. I need to go hydrate. One second. Wait two seconds, I gotta get a drink.
I am here. No, I don't drink tea. <laughs> yeah, I drink, uh... I just drink... I just drink... Blah. I just drink juice, really. The only, like, hot drink I really have is hot chocolate. Which is pretty good. It's pretty tasty. Your beer stug. Beer stug. Right. Yeah, I think after this, I'll probably do a. Okay. I think after this, I might do a... I might hop on Minecraft and work on my Minecraft world a bit more. That's what I was doing last stream. Um... That was pretty chill. I want to start a new Minecraft Hardcore series, because... For those of you who don't know, I had a, I had a Minecraft Hardcore series on this Twitch. Uh, but then I died to an Enderman, so... <laughs> that happened. Because I didn't cheese it. I got too cocky, like I thought, oh, you know, I don't need to cheese it, I'll be fine. And then I got owned, so... <laughs> Alright. I think I'm gonna switch over to Minecraft. Because I think we've seen everything there really is to see with, with uh, 3D Blast. And then tomorrow, either tomorrow or Thursday, um, we're gonna do... Uh, what's it called? We're gonna do the Saturn version. Which is a bit different. I'm also going to do Sonic Jam in the same stream, if I can get them both working. So yeah, I think that's going to do it for this game. We're going to switch over to Minecraft, I think. So, I'm going to change the stream title and whatnot. Minecraft. Brown Bricks. I'm just going to call it Brown Bricks. <laughs> Alright. I'm gonna unplug my controller. Alright, I'm just gonna work on my Minecraft world for a bit. What time is Pretzel's uh, stream? Let me check real quick. What time? Blech, they go live. Oh, the pin. I could do pinball for like. I could do that for like a minute and then switch over. Oh wait, they go live in like fifteen minutes. Hmm. You know, actually, I might do Minecraft. Uh, hmm. You know what? I'm gonna quickly go on my Minecraft world for like half an hour and then there uh, go Red Fretzel. All right. Uh, Minecraft. Sounds good to me. Here we go. No, I don't want to download the new Minecraft launcher. Get out of here. I'm going to get the music playlist on. Streaming jams. Here we go. You know, yeah, I'll get pinball up in a minute. Don't worry, Freckle Slam. Don't worry. Here we go. Just one moment. Do 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 No, what a white gif. I love that gif. Such a good gif. Pinball, here's pinball. Okay, where's window capture? Cap window capture. Okay, here you go. Here's, here's your funny pinball. I'll do like one round and then I'll switch to Minecraft. 
Pepsi man! Okay. You know, we already did Sonic Spinball, but uh, I guess this is, this is Sonic Spinball 3, because we also did the Infant version. Okay. Oh, oh, oh never mind. <laughs> okay. Surprisingly, I never really played this growing up. I played like Minesweeper a fair bit, and, like some of the other games that came with Windows XP. But for some reason, I just never really played this one. I remember when like the whole people used to meme like, oh yeah, everybody plays Solitaire. Now it's kind of like a precursor of mobile games. Right, I guess Solitaire and how people got really hooked on it in like the late 90s, early 2000s. That was basically the, the precursor to like modern, to like modern mobile games like Candy Crush and whatnot. Pretty interesting. Yeah, I'm, I'm not real. This? Okay. There's something really goofy about me playing Space Cadet Pinball to the Pepsi Man theme while it's in the Minecraft category. <laughs> There's something really goofy about that. Yeah, there you go. Let's go. No! Alright. And that's game. We have died. Brown bricks, you must have a poop mod installed. <laughs> Brown bricks. Alright. Maya greened. Alright. So I have a really good resource pack enabled. Wait, wait, wait. How loud's the... Okay, that's good. I have this amazing resource pack. The image is just, is just Coach Z with laser eyes also. Really good. So I need to show this off. These, these are my Minecraft worlds. <laughs> I changed all the icons. So you got Obama. You got Fievel gets trolled. A raccoon. A Pinkie Pie. And you got Obama crying for the icon. <laughs> yeah, like, the really old, like, the classic versions of Minecraft run on, like, Windows XP and whatnot. It's pretty interesting. Alright. Oh, this is the wrong world, actually. Wait. It's this one I should be going on. I think Stuck's seen this, but I wanted to, like, show Stuck anyways. Look at this. So the sounds have all been changed. Wait, wait, wait. Meh. Meh. I really love this. <laughs> Go pinata. So all the sounds are just me doing goat sounds <laughs> in this pack. So we had I had Zinnia voicing the axe lol. But the issue was, so all of the axolotl sounds were replaced for Zinnia making these nuts jokes, 
and it got really, really annoying really quick. Because I have an axe lot in my I have an axe lot in my Minecraft house, right? <laughs> and it got really obnoxious really quick, and I just got tired of it, <laughs> and I just disabled it. But I, yeah, do you guys want me to enable it? Do you want me to turn on the Zinnia Axolotl? Uh, if you're in the chat, Zinnia, um, are you okay with me showing your voice on stream, or would you rather me not? Just, I gotta make sure, actually, first, before I show it. But yeah. Oh yeah, that's all sound. <laughs> it's just me shouting, shouting raccoon as I ram into the horse. <laughs> it's so good. Zinnia voice are real. I just gotta get Zinnia's like, make sure Zinnia's okay with it. All right, yeah, that's fine, Zinnia. If you if you're only comfortable with it, you can also find Genki for the texture here as well. It's a really good texture. Wait, is it a one? Okay. So I'm gonna head into my main world now. Obama land free, the Obamaning. Okay. So this is the world I've been working oh I accidentally dropped the This is what I've been working on as of late. I need to get all the uh, what's it called? Oh, that, okay, that's only two blocks I right. Where are the Gortoons, Clash? Where are the Gortoons? So this is the world I'm working on. I have a bunch of villages set up in here. So now because of that, Iron Golems are starting to spawn. <laughs> so there's like a village right over there. I built up my fort- I built up my little house here. And there was a vill there's like a village right there. So I just abducted all the villages and put them in this little house. So they're not going to get killed by the zombies. And now we have iron golems starting to naturally spawn around my base. And that's pretty funny. <laughs> huh. Huh. So yeah, that's one thing I'm doing. Oh yeah, I need to make the music louder again. Nah, Zinnia, you have a great voice. I love your voice. Okay. Yeah, that's alright, Zinnia, don't worry. Alright. Okay, it's midday, so I'm gonna get some fishing done. At the minute, my main goal is getting mending on all my armor and everything. Like Shy Guy from Mario. That's just my goal right now, is to get mending on everything. And I'm trying to get as many emeralds as I can also. Um, so that way I can... Because I know one of the villages has a mending book too. So I'm trying to get a ton of um, emeralds. So, yeah. That's the current plan. I think what I might try and do is venture out and just try and find another village. So I can see if I can do any trades with those guys. But we'll see. Yeah, I, I, I know who Todd Howard is. The legend. That is a good, uh... I mean, who, do, who, who doesn't, like, nowadays know who Todd Howard is? Or watch a YouTube video? What, what do you want me to watch, Freckle Slam? Alright.
Let me get this on. Okay, what's this? Todd Howard. Alright, um... Window capture. Here we go. At this point, I think it's fair to say most people are aware that Todd Howard voiced a test NPC in Oblivion named Albin Cor Corinus. However, it isn't the only character he voiced. In a recent interview at PAXES 2019, Todd mentioned how he voiced the... Daedric Prince... Calvi is vile in a few, a few other Elder Scrolls games. These games were Red Guard and Oblivion. Today I'll be showing you the Todd Howard's work. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright. Uh, I got tired of 3D Blast, so I switched over to Minecraft. Cause that 3D Blast got really tiring after a bit, so... Todd Howard's work. Good for you. That really pisses me off. <laughs> Did you know that? It's a pleasure to be here with you. You are indeed a bastard. Oh my god, Todd Howard. Good. <laughs> a mortal! Wonderful. Always a pleasure. Perhaps a true service for me, mortal. And I'll reward you. A fair bargain, don't you think? Oh god, Bring Todd the sword Howard. To me, and I'll reward you with my mask. You'll not find a better bargain, mortal. Begin your search in Hell's Gate. Excellent! A Thank you, Todd Howard. Very cool. In exchange for a mask fit for a god. You've gotten the better of this bargain, mortal. Now, I have business to attend to. Run along. Perhaps I'll be looking for you again. You will break our bargain? You dare trifle with me? <laughs> Take care, mortal. Clavicus Vile watches you now and waits. Todd Howard, the legend. Strategy is a Todd's credit. Damn, poor Todd. Poor Gamer wasn't credited. So sad. So sad. <laughs> All right. So yeah, I was gonna mention, so like, I was thinking about this yesterday. What was I gonna say? That you were saying before, Freckle Slam, you were surprised that I'd never, like, beaten Oblivion. And it's kind of funny, because like, technically, so my all-time favorite game, Fallout New Vegas, Fallout New Vegas, was built off of Fallout 3, which was also built off of, of Oblivion. So I guess in like a weird technical technical way, you could see I played quite a bit of uh, <laughs> quite a bit of Oblivion. It it does remind me of how so like some modern games like Titanfall Two, that game is built off the Source Engine, right? Well, not actually. So, like, a game like Half-Life Alex, that's on the Source 2 engine. The Source 2 engine is based on the Source engine, right? The Source engine is based on the Gold Source engine, which gave us Half-Life. The Gold Source engine is based off the Quake engine, which gave us Quake. The Quake engine is based off the Doom engine. And the Doom engine, I'm pretty sure, is, like, you can go back to, like, Wolfenstein 3D. That's how... Basically, Half-Life Alex is a very, very, very heavily modified version of Wolfenstein 3D. If you want to get, like, really technical, and that's really funny to me. <laughs> it's all coming together. It's just a pillar of duct tape. <laughs> that's how these games are made. Every single game in existence is, like, built off the other. Again, why am I getting so many fishing rods? Really good Hollow Knight music. Oblivion has lighting spells. Oh god, you can make a you can make a zap build in Oblivion. Uh. 
Ugh, I wish this game would. I wish this game would give me some enchanted books sometime. I would really appreciate. I think the book got broken. I, I don't know why it doesn't work. I think it's bit amounts actually. Yeah, that's it. Bit amounts. I live walking distance from my local <laughs> police department. If another person uses my NFT without my consent, I will report them immediately. This is my property. The transaction has been verified scientifically on the blockchain. Anyone who violates my NFT rights will pay the price. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Stuck. <laughs> One time, I was playing Toontown Online on the family laptop. I thought it'd be funny to do the glass of water gag in real life, so I took a glass of water and I spat it all over my parents. That one's actually a true story as well. That actually happened. <laughs> Thank you, Stug. <laughs> That's actually a true story. Yeah, I was just playing Toontown on the laptop, and I just took a glass of water, like, I thought I'd do the glass of water gag in real life, so I just spat it all over them. That's a true story. <laughs>So in this world, I have one, two, three, four, five. I have like five dogs. Is it three of? I have four dogs. I have a cat, an axolotl, named D's. I have two birds. What do you? Oh god, yeah, that's a funny story as well. So when I was really young, when I was on like the playground, I would go around headbutting people. I would, I would just scream. Sonic attack! And I would like go around headbutting people, pretending to be Sonic. Oh god, I remember that. <laughs> That's such a dumb story, but I love it. Just as a kid, I would just go around headbutting people, pretending to be Sonic, and just screaming Sonic attack. And I guess you can see how it's foreshadowing for like the whole goal thing too. Sonic attack! So you got my horse too, we got four dogs, two birds, a fish. Pretty good world. Um, okay. I'm gonna toss these in here. Here, fish. You want some fishing rods? Toss that in there. Cats! Yeah, we call it Catherine. And we got two birds, so I don't. I don't have any names for the dogs or the birds. I need to think of some names for them. Welcome to Obama Land, the third one. Population these. Oh yeah, I need a name for the horse as well. Not that I ever not that I, not blah, blah, blah. not that I ever use the horse, but you know. Oh yeah, I got the other dog. I got the other dog here that also needs a name. Okay. Do I even want to ask what that means? What that name means? I feel like I'm gonna get Jabeard if I ask. I'm sure it's just a name. I don't know the meme, I don't know what that is. It reminds me of the time. This I'm actually reminded of the time that um so back when the original Coach C was streaming um Corporal Clash. Oh my god. So Quackity went into one of Coach's streams and just started making a bunch of D's Nuts jokes. I just remember that. Okay, what's this? 
Oh, okay, that meme. That meme. Okay, I forgot about that one. Okay, Zinnia sent me it as well. <laughs> okay, fine, I'll call it Juan. I know how it's pronounced. I'll say Juan. Here. Okay. Alright, we'll call it Juan. <laughs> Alright. What? The whitest wear? <laughs> this is the new... Eating raffles. Alright, we'll call the horse that. Watch me accidentally give it to a cow or something. Yeah, I did give it to the horse, right? Okay, I did. When are they gonna add? When are they gonna add never write horse armor? When are they adding it? Okay. Queer Sadilla. Queer That's how you say. You join the fish and what's going Ugh. It's a funny word, it's a funny word. I'm just looking at this actually, I should maybe make it sleep. Yeah, that's a bit better. <laughs> you feel personally attacked. Look, I'm just bad at pronouncing words. You know, I'll, I'll have you know. I am neurodivergent and also a minor. Okay. Okay, yeah, this one should be a. Uh, what's it called? Here we go. Get the hole in here. The Splatoon music. Jossie, Jossie. I have quite a bit of Splatoon music in this playlist, actually. <laughs> I don't know, I don't know how to pronounce words. I'm bad at pronouncing words. I'm terrible at it. Oh, you have a family member called that? <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh man. Crazy stuff. Ugh. You're not laughing at me. <laughs> I'd imagine, I'd imagine. Alright, you know what? It looks like the fishing just isn't gonna work out. It's not... The game doesn't want to be nice today. I'm gonna put the fishing rod back on there. Put these in here. Okay. I think what I want to do next is I want to... What's I going to do again? Yo! Thank you, chicken. <laughs> okay, what's this video? Okay, I'll watch this. Oh, that's one of your videos? Wait, wait, I'll watch that. Uh, window capture. In the corporate class lore, mice tunes are actually space aliens from the planet Cheese World. <laughs> Thank you, Stuck. That's such a good alert. <laughs> it's such a good alert. 
I like so when I first got Twitch affiliate, I like asked Nick if he could record a raccoon. I asked Nick if he could record a um alert, and that was what we came up with. <laughs> okay, what do you think of Clash Mice? <laughs> okay. Hey, Sim. Have you seen my cousin, Deez? Bruh. Deez, huh? I can't say I have. Deez nuts! <laughs> Deez nuts? <laughs> oh my god. Freckle Summers from Cheese World? Holy crap. <laughs> the planet Cheese World. My God, okay, that was an amazing video, by the way. Chicken, <laughs> that was an amazing video. Okay, I got I'm getting pinged. Zinnies from the planet D's. Holy crap! All right, so I the pretzel is live now with Sonic R. I think I'm gonna go raid them. Yeah, I was gonna go for a little bit longer, but I wanna go and support that stream. So I'm gonna find a way to like end the stream well. Okay, what do we do? Like before we end, I, I gotta do something funny. Hmm. I'm gonna. I don't know, what do I do? What, what funny thing? The thank you stuck, that stalled me. <laughs> I, I think that's a good way to end it. <laughs> Just jump scaring me like that. Okay. <laughs> I think that's a good way to end it. Okay. I think that's a good way to end off the stream. <laughs> We're gonna uh red. What's a good red message? Before we leave, what's a good red message? Hmm. Bye, Skyrim. <laughs> hmm. It just works. Hmm. By Skyrim. Alright, I'll do Maya Spooky. That's the red message, just by Skyrim. Alright. So, thanks everybody for dropping by. I really do appreciate it. Um, thanks for all the bits and whatnot during this stream. Thanks for the gift sub as well, Frackle Slam. I really appreciate it. Um, everybody who dropped by today. I'll see you all soon. Um, we're gonna go raid Hot Pretzel. I'm gonna join their voice chat in like a few minutes as well. I just gotta let my dogs out first, and then I'm gonna join their call. They're all they're doing Sonic R and whatnot, so it's gonna be really fun. Uh, be sure to post. Be sure to put the uh, the funny red message in the chat. Maybe maybe in the future. Maybe in the future. All right. I'll see you all soon. <laughs>